Good morning. I'm here on the campus of Timbuktu Manufacturing in Gardena, California, called TMI, to introduce you today to a new machine that just was introduced a couple months ago by the Timbuktu company. That is the Flipper. The Flipper comes in three different models, the 1300, the 2200, and the 03 H35. The 1300 and the 2200 are pretty basically the same machine with different variations of motors and pumps that we can put inside. The 1300 is one three-stage and 120 PSI pump. The 2200 has two two-stage and, two, and, and a 120 PSI pump. Options are more bigger pumps. Options are in the, in the Flipper 03 A35, you can get one three-stage with a heater and a 120 PSI pump, all on one cord. Uh, the machine comes with a 17-foot hose and it comes with a hand tool. Another option is you can also have a uh, what we call the Auto Seal One. This is a one with a uh, plastic kit, rotational plastic, made of the same material as the machine is made of. This has a five-year guarantee, as it does the body for the flipper. So this and this is the state of the art. This is the latest thing. This weighs half of what your stainless steel one weighs right now. This does a better job of picking up. We've done tests, and you can get 90% of the water you put into the carpet back through this machine back to this one, and that's what we want for you to do. Let me talk about the flipper now. The flipper is a five gallon machine. As I've already told you, it's a rotational plastic. I've already told you the equipment that comes with it. It is made so it creates a small footprint. As you can tell, all the wheels are tucked up in the, underneath the machine, so that when you go to store this in your, in your garage or your closet or wherever you store it, even in your car, it's not gonna take a lot of room. It's not gonna have wheels outside the machine it's going to be real easy to take care of. There are three switches on, on all, most of the machines, and they're all ergonomically positioned. So it's just easy for you to take care of this, and they don't extend, they don't get smashed up if you run something by it. It's pretty simple. The back of the machine here is your vacuum hose connection, your solution line connection, and your dirty water dump out. When your dirty water dump out, you gotta make sure that you're pointing this away from you and into your drain immediately. This thing will drain, I don't know what the exact measurement is, but if the whole tank is full, it's gonna be in eight to 15 seconds. So it's gonna come out quick. There are, there are six wheels on this machine. Two here, they're 10 inch rear wheels. Two in the front, those are three inch casters. And these right here, and this is for the handle that's adjustable. So if you had to store this or put this in your car or put this in anywhere, you can put it like here and then it'll roll real easy for you. That way you can, you can make sure that you uh, are using this and it's easy on you to, to move around and, and do what you got to do with it. It has a ball full of filter on the inside. It simply twists off. You take the part, this the ball full of filter off of the ball float. You rinse this off if it's not real bad and you put it back on the ball float. The thing about here is we recommend every time you use your machine after the day, rinse this off. After a week, if you're doing a few jobs, rinse it off and if it's real, real bad, it change it. These are not real expensive and they may extend the life of your motors much more than if you didn't use it. The whole unit goes right back on here simply by twisting on and you're ready to go. This machine has two knobs in the front and the back for it to hold the compartments together. It simply comes out, it unscrews out, and the whole unit opens like that. Now you have easy access to your motors and your pump. If for whatever reason you're having a problem, you can see what you got, you can get to it fairly easily. The uh, unit fills up real easy. In this compartment on the top, on the lid, there's, there's openings. So that when you lay this down, you don't have to open up the whole unit to fill your water. You can simply take your water bucket and pour it right into the machine like that. And, it's, and you don't have water running down the sides. You don't have all this stuff happening. You don't have water going into your switches, which is a common problem with some of the older machines. Uh, that is pretty basically the flipper. So now we're ready to connect our machine, our hose up to our machine. You have two hoses. This is the, the bigger one that's your vacuum hose. This is the smaller one that's your solution hose. These are the same for all three, for two of the three models. The two, the 1300 and the 2200 have this hose exactly. The O3 H35 is a heater hose that will have a high pressure hose here. That's the only difference. They connect the vacuum hose here. And when these are brand new, they're very stiff. And the solution line right here, 
you must hear that click. If you don't hear that click, then the water pressure is not going to go through. And that's all there is to it. Just got to make sure that it runs right. The whole machine, like I said, will turn on a dime. You got a, you got yourself a nice little piece of equipment right here. And then you're ready to work. And this is a hand tool. This is just called. This is the HT1. It comes with the machines, like I told you, and it's ready to go. This is for basically for auto detailing. You can also use this hand tool for stairs. Uh, any place that you can't fit the big one, you can also use this one right here. It's so much easier to handle if that's all you're working with. 